To explain the process of heating up springs, I'm going to use this spring to demonstrate. So uh, what I learned during the process was, um, let's say for instance I start heating it at this point. So you keep the flame at this point until if you heat it up here it's going to sag on the side so this point on the opposite end is going to compress and sit on top of that coil so you do the same thing if you heat it up here it's going to compress on this side and then depending on the height that you want um, you will be able to to work on it in that manner so just note if you hit it here it's not going to drop here it's going to drop here you hit it here it's going to drop here so i just thought it would be interesting for you guys to know